Why dogs get stuck after mating? Dogs get stuck together as the final step in their mating process. It's something that nearly all canines do, including wolves and foxes. During intercourse, a part of the male dog's penis called the bulbous glandy swells and prevents him from pulling out. Essentially, the pair are locked together until the swelling subsides. However, once penetration has been produced, the male tends to dismount the female but stays attached. The dog will likely turn around to face the opposite direction. But getting stuck means they can't go anywhere. This leads the guardians of both animals to wonder why the dogs have been stuck after mating and how to separate them. This happens because the dog's ejaculation occurs in three phases. Number 1. Urethral phase. This takes place during the beginning of the penetration. And therein the dog first ejects a liquid free of sperm. Penetration does not occur due to an engorged penis, but through the baculum, also known as the penis bone. Number 2. Sperm phase. After the first ejaculation, the animal completes engorgement and starts a second ejaculation, this time with sperm. During this process, there is an increase in penile bulb size due to venous compression of the penis and consequent blood concentration. At this point, the male turns around and dismounts the female, leaving the dog stuck. Number 3. Prostatic phase. While the male has already removed the penis from the female, copulation has not ended. As once the dog has turned away, the so-called nodding occurs. This is also known as the copulation tie. The penile bulb remains engorged in the vagina. The expulsion of the third ejaculation has a much lower number of sperm than the last. Once the bulb relaxes and recovers its normal state, the dogs are unstuck. The copulatory tie is totally normal and is an important part of canine breeding behavior. Separation of the male and female will happen naturally once the bulbous glandes is no longer engorged. The copulatory tie lasts anywhere from 5 to 60 minutes, 30 being the usual average. If you have understood the reason for dogs getting stuck together, you will know trying to break them apart is dangerous. The dog's female and male anatomy does not allow the removal of the penis before the end of the dog's third ejaculation. If you separate them forcefully, both animals would be wounded and harmed. Not only would intercourse not come to its end, but you could serious rupture their sexual organs. The animals need to carry out their natural mating process, allowing them a relaxed and comfortable atmosphere. Once the three phases of the ejaculation of the male have been reviewed, we see how the copulation tie gives us the answer to the question of why dogs get stuck when mating. The expansion of the penile bulb locks the male into the female. The size it becomes means it cannot pass through the vaginal vestibule, which closes precisely to ensure this fact and avoid damage to the female. 